Remember, he came and paid the price for your sins. Hallelujah. He died, was buried, and then raised back to life for your justification. He did it all for you. He didn't do it for himself. He didn't do it for God. God was in Christ reconciling the world to himself. He did it for you so that you no longer have to do it. Everything about your salvation was consummated in him. Praise Jesus. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Praise Praise the Lord. Lord. Who is seated at the right hand mm -hmm. of the majesty on high. I get so excited when oh, I think yeah, about yeah. this because the mm. flavor of true faith mm. is rest. Mm -hmm. Faith yes. is not a struggle. If no. you mm. thought that faith was about making a whole pile of confessions, I'm going to make it work, I'm going to make it work, I'm going to make it work, and <laughs> working it to make it work, mm. you've missed the point. Mm. Mm. Those things result from a revelation that they're already yours. Like Jesus You're did. You're confessing peace. what already belongs to you. Yeah, he knew mm. peace, peace was his. He wasn't mm. trying to argue for peace. He wasn't fighting with the These devil. Waters, peace. This water is this rain. Dog, 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 get out the way. You know? <laughs> he just said peace. 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 Because still. The, he was the prince of peace. Yes. And he had peace and he drew it from the inside. Do you know? The Garden of Eden is on the inside of you. And you can just draw from that inheritance, from heaven. We dwell in heavenly places. Mm. You just draw from the inside what you desire because it's all been done for you and you are already there. You are seated with Christ in heavenly places. Hallelujah. Wow. Do you know what I, what, I, what I like about the last statement you just read from today's message, uh, Deborah? It says, who is seated at the right hand mm. of the majesty on high. Right. You know, many people, when, when, when you say seated at the right hand of the majesty on high, they imagine, oh, so he's seated at the actual right hand seat. side. Mm. side. Mm. And yet, mm. right hand is actually a, a oh, position yeah. of authority. Sorry. That's, right. That's yes. what it, it symbolizes, mm. that he's sitting in a position of authority. And Pastor is often told us that sitting is not a position of any work. Mm -hmm. It's a position of rest. Yeah. Wow. And so he's seated, wow. sitting, resembling wow. he's at rest. Every time you sit, like we're sitting right now, it's a position of rest. Yes, exactly. He's not standing at the right the hand of the Father. Mm. He said he is seated, seated. and we oh, are so seated so together mm. with him in the heavenly places. We are sitting right. together with him. It says we are standing mm. together with him. It says we are seated. Yeah. A position yeah. of rest. Yeah. A position of yeah. everything is okay. Yeah. You, know, you know when you're fretting and anxious and you control. pace. Yes. You pace up and down. down. Wow. But when everything is in wow. control and everything is calm, you sit. And, you right. and, you yeah. Yeah. Like, and that's the position we <laughs> Are oh, in, yeah. in heavenly places. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. You know, I keep on thinking earlier in, in the month we shared on the communion, and that every time you take the communion, Jesus said, Do this in remembrance of mm. me. And every time you take the communion, which we suggested in that teaching, you do often, and that's what Pastor was sharing with us. And every time you take the communion, you remind yourself the work is finished. Oh, yes. I'm at a place of rest. Mm. The work is is finished because the devil will often try to come nudge you with little suggestions and lies that will want to put you into a place of stress again. <gasps> Maybe the situation's not under control. Mm -hmm. Maybe my faith isn't working. Maybe this, maybe that. And next, before you know it, you're being tossed to and fro by the storms of life. And when you've entered into God's rest, like you were just saying At now, that point, all you, you say is all things, things are, are working, working together, together for, for my good. good. That's the rest. Yeah. Praise you have God. all things are working together for my good. You just apply the word mm. and you remain calm. Hallelujah. You know, yes. You know, very, very interesting. Hebrews chapter 4 verse 11. It says, labor to enter into the rest. Mm, mm, mm. You know, it's not easy to enter into that rest. In the, in the sense, if you do not have the word of God. If you, do, if you, are, if you are in a position of unrest, it's, a, it's indicative of the word that is in you. Mm. The more word you have mm. in you, the more rest you are mm. in. So the and more studying you need to do, to course, the laboring is in actually investing the word of in God in your, your, your spirit. That's right. Mm. Interesting, because Hebrews chapter 4 verse 11 says, labor to enter the rest. And it says, in verse 4 it says, fall, which means it's, it's continuing, continuing the, the yes. conversation. Fall. The word is active, active, quick, and powerful. And then so the word the, does the work. Exactly. Mm. The word Hallelujah. does the work. It's Hallelujah. the word. We have to work the word. I mean, and it's been a 
process. I've got so many testimonies where I would start out fretting, <laughs> absolutely fretting over a situation. And as I learned to apply that word and learned to apply that word, I mean today, today, when I think about what I fretted about, I can hardly it's believe ridiculous. it's the same it's person. Unrest is a terrible place to be in. Ask me. It's a terrible place to be in. <laughs> we don't want to know. We've entered into yes. this. <laughs> the more that you allow that word to work in you, the rest comes. Glory Amen. to God. Yeah. And it comes. I'm Amen. telling you, it comes. Amen. What a place to be in. A place Amen. of rest. But I like Hallelujah. what you've emphasized there. It doesn't just come because you've been told it. Mm. Through the word of God, you will enter into yes, the rest of God. Yes. The Word of God, as you meditate on the Word of God, it will all your anxieties, all the cares of this life will cease. Yes. And it will be, it's a supernatural thing. Yes. That rest comes from yes. God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Pastor Hallelujah. continues and he says, But thanks be unto God. You're seated together with Him. Oh, you must picture yourself like that. Mm. You mm. must see yourself like that, that I'm seated together with him. The devil's far down <laughs> under your feet. You must know that and you must see that. Far, not even under my feet. They're no. too anointed for him to be there. I mean, <laughs> far, far, far. He says, thanks be unto God. You're seated together with him in that place of power, authority, Amen. and rest. Amen. And hath raised us up together and made us sit together in heavenly places in Christ Jesus. That was a scripture from Ephesians chapter 2 verse 6. Mm, Praise the Lord. To Listen to this. He says, Jesus is not doing any work today in heaven. Oh, that's glorious. He's seated and resting. And since you're seated with him, it means no more struggling Hallelujah. for you. Hallelujah. That statement alone, you can it. take it and oh. meditate mm, on it mm, night mm. and day, mm. and you will see the peace of God that will garrison your heart. That's That's right. Right. You've been ushered Thank into a Jesus. life of rest. Praise Glory Lord. to God. Hallelujah. It's a position oh, of grace. Lord. It's a position Glory of grace. In Christ Jesus, Lord. all Glory your problems have Praise been solved. Jesus. All your Hallelujah. problems, not some. Not not just your financial problems and your children are lit up. Not just your children are so children problems are solved. All your problems, any problem that you have, you could think of. All your problems in Christ Jesus. All your problems have been solved. Oh, Therefore, hallelujah. look hallelujah. to him. Oh, look unto Jesus, the hallelujah. author and perfecter of our faith. Hallelujah. Therefore, look to him. Look away. Look away and look unto Jesus. Look away Amen. from the problem. Look away from the Amen. situation and look unto Jesus, who's your author and perfecter of your faith. This is what Pastor Chris says. He says, Therefore, look to him, Amen. for he's the solution. And all that you could ever Hallelujah. need. He's God. all that Hallelujah. you could ever yeah. need. Glory Praise to God. God. That song Praise just keeps God. on coming to my heart. He is more than enough. Oh, yes. <laughs> we worship <laughs> him today. Hallelujah. Oh, he's Lord. more than enough oh, and he's our Lord. rest. Lord. We're at enough. peace. Oh. Praise because of Christ in us. Mm. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Yeah, Glory praise. to God. This is beautiful. After listening to such a beautiful message, join us as we take today's prayer together. Dear Father, Dear Father, I thank you for the blessing of your word. I thank 